Welcome to Asset Plant Machinery. Today we're going to overview our Stillmaster Industrial SM1440B. Our 1440B is offered in two models. We've got a, uh, a 240 volt 1.8 15 amp single phase and also a three phase 1.8 uh, three phase model as well. They're both the same lathe. We just put them off with two different optional power requirements. So uh, you, you can use the, the 240 volt at home or in a workshop or anywhere like that. The main difference being on the three phase machine is we have a two speed uh, box down the bottom there so we can go high and low range and the three phase machine only has the 16 speed so it's uh, the lowest speed is 35 and the highest speed is 1900. On the single phase machine uh, you've got uh, eight speed selectors and it's a single speed motor with eight uh, speed selectors the, the slowest being 70 and the highest being 1900. So we'll run through uh, some of the features of our 1440B starting from the headstock uh, it's all interlocked, so we've got interlocked limit switch cutoff, so uh, if it's open, the machine doesn't work, which meets workplace safety. 1440B has a 51mm spindle bore, very, very popular when you're doing sort of a 50mm or 2-inch shaft. We fit all of our lathes in, in this range here with a rear spindle spider, so that spindle spider there can be adjusted if you're doing shaft work and, um, and barrel work as well. So we'll lock that up there, move over here. 1440B's uh, also fitted off with our new ES8A uh, two-axis digital readout. So that works in metric and imperial. So that gives you um, digital control or digital display of where your longitudinal and cross-speed are. Uh, two-axis feeds, as I said, we, we engage the levers here to, uh, to have power saddle feed and also cross-feed. On the headstock, we've got the jog button there as well. So the jog button makes it easy to change gears. Uh, one of the uh, popular items on our 1440B, we've got four types of thread cutting. We've got metric, imperial, modular, and DP all down there as well. So we've got a huge thread cutting range on our 1440Bs. Everything's easily adjusted by the headstock gear. The ABCs, one, two, threes, very, very simple to use. So covered lead screws, uh, in, uh, interlocked uh, chuck guards. We've got a 200 uh, millimeter three jaw chuck with reverse jaws fitted standard. Uh, also, it's uh, supplied with a four jaw chuck, 200 mil, and a face plate as well. So we close that and um, we'll just crank that up. That's that's in high range now, so we'll just sort of fire that up and sort of show that running. So that's on about uh, 950 revs, and you can hear that very, very smooth operation. So simply hit the foot brake and she turns it off again. So change that across to low range, simple as that as well. And that's in low range, that's running at around 300 revs. So very good lathe, very good size lathe as well. Uh, well priced, well featured. We've got a heavy duty industrial LED work light. We've got uh, fixed and traveling steadies. Uh, all the, you know, the, the two handles here are calibrated in metric and imperial. So it um, depends on uh, which side of the, you know, the, the training set you're trained at. Uh, we've got the quick action uh, tool post there as well. So they come with three holders. Uh, we've got a huge range of accessories in stock as well to actually pick that up. So um, nice and easy to change, but you know, thread chasing dial, uh, four more taper on the uh, the tail stock. We've got front full out swarf tray. We've got everything here. So that's nice and easy to, uh, to, to clean out the, um, the swarf in the front. So that's our 1440B, one of our most popular uh, single phase lays because of all the features, the thread cutting, the big ball, and the 1.8 uh, by 15 amp uh, single phase power supply so and uh, the optional three phase as mentioned before so jump onto assetplant.com.au and see the full range of photos and technical data online thanks and have a great day